Greetings fellow YouTubians, the Secret Snake here, bringing another episode of Minecraft Chrono Miner. And I think I got it all. This episode we are going to do, I was, I'm not sure yet, I'm, I'm debating on um, uh, logistics pipes. I want logistics pipes, but Again, I also need a better sorting system and all that, and I think applied energistics may be the way to go. But I'm not sure how to use both. So anyway, um, I decided to turn this episode on. Not really ready, but I did it because I wanted to show you the reason I went through the trouble of, with pneumatic craft creating this helmet. And I'm down to 1.4 bars. Um, Keep looking on the screen, you'll see it. It's here somewhere, I saw it. Somewhere over there, there they go. See, now I can find down, way down here at Y level 6. I found a monster thingy. Chest and a monster. Oh, and it even tells you what's in it. Four smiths, four shards, gunpowder red, saddle, fiery net, tears. Spawner type zombie. Next spawn in one second. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Canola seeds. That's good. No, that's cool. I'm gonna go over there because that's what the helmet's for. <laughs> and believe me, I am a long ways from home. I've just been digging pretty much in one direction. Oh yeah, I had that. So, yeah, we're long ways. Well, anyway, it just keeps going. <laughs> Told you I'd come and do some mining, mainly to level up. Whoa! I better check that. I've been using it a lot. Ooh, yeah, that's not good. Okay. Back over here. Where did I have the portal going? I don't guess it's anywhere important. Besides, I need to get this inventory. Alright, uh, let's see here. I haven't been doing much mining, just digging. Oh, I found some dark iron, by the way. Uh, I've been converting a lot of cobble into compressed cobble. Yeah, between that helmet and We'll put the helmet, I mean the portal, here. I said there, there, darn it. Alright, whoa, definitely don't want this on. And let's turn tracker off. First things first, I guess. We'll take care of this inventory. I shall be back as soon as I finish this up. We'll start. 
I'll be back. Okay, I've emptied the inventory and just finishing up here with some stuff. Yeah. I thought I had enough of that. Let's see here. Go. Oh, yeah. This is probably done. I don't see it doing anything. Yeah, it's done. 63 gold and 20 diamond. And I might make a few of these. All right.
I actually like the way these rods looked before. Now they look stupid. Just keep heading this way. Temp. <laughs> I can just stand right here, and dig a tunnel. It doesn't say how far away it is, though. found a couple um, somewhere around down here uh, uh, aura nodes I took one of them Looks like I'm right. A little, need to go a little higher. Yeah. This looks, I think, about right. zombie chain or break it. That's not what I wanted. I hate that. I put it on something and it opened something else. Annoying. Aggravating.
Eh, why not? Basically, there's really nothing in this. A sucky chamber, but nah. What can you do? I think I just seen my helmet shut off. I did. Thought I did. Zero point four, yeah. It's time to go charge this up. Alright, I'm going to let this fill up. It's going to take a little while. And I'll be back. Actually, I'm just going to leave that up there to charge. I think I'm done mining for a while. I don't know what I got in here. the hell to put bread.
why that's in there. I guess that's all of it. I think. That's good enough if it isn't. Don't seem right to me. Oh, sort order. There we go. They're all called mana beam, you stupid shoot. I guess you can't order this sand that. Alright, let's see what we got here. None, really? I did unlock an entry for a boss battle. An earth thingy. That's interesting. This opens up to the same with the book that I got in my backpack. So I opened this up down there when I leveled up. Anyway. Let's see what I wanted to see. Oh boy. Actually, I'm not doing this this episode because I forgot I'm going to go into the config and change some settings. Well, one setting. Turn the power requirement off because we're not going to do logistics. You know, you know everything logistics. I'm going to go with applied and logistics, I think, and use this for advanced sorting and things from other stuff but with that we do need I do need a way to hmm. I need a block of redstone iron <coughs> damn it Move. I think you'll appreciate this. It's pretty cool. I'm going to have it so I can have portable um, portable backpack thing so I can just dump my stuff pull stuff out remote remote access and deposit so to speak and I guess I could turn that back on I'm not gonna worry with it right now though um, let's see what can I check on my helmet good enough. The question is, yeah, it's at eight, so let's shut it down. Either that or I'm out of coal. All right. 
Oh, actually, I can just do it from here. Okay. Actually, I think. might make it go over, but since this is pulling out of it, it might not. So I might get more than 4.5. Anyway, let's see. We need... Well, I better stay up here. I don't... I'll be back. I don't want to see this place blow up, so... Yeah. Keep an eye on this. I'll be back. Oh, um, and I can't wait for Dyer to complete his, that's what I was afraid of. Uh, next episode of his Let's Play, he just. Let's see how high I can get this without blowing up the system. He just got working on uh, pneumatic craft in his Let's Play series and I think it's he's like on episode 78 or something like that anyway um, he seems to be trying to set it up identical to the way he did it in Forgecraft 2 which isn't gonna work because there is no API mm. I don't think he realizes that but regardless he's he knows what he's doing so I'm going to watch and see how he deals with it with the code. So hopefully, I might come up with a better code using his, or at least figure out how to get mine to work the way I want. Uh, anyway, I'm hoping anyway, I'm just going to watch his episode when it comes back, and then we'll see what he does. And I'll know what I'm going to do. Okay. 4.6. This one's almost off. We're safe. Yeah, and this one's off already. This one's off. And I got a maximum of what? 4.7, I would hope. Yep. 4.7, and it still seems to be climbing. No. So, 4.7, I think, is it. We're 30 minutes in, so I was going to, what I'm going to do is go ahead and prep. What I want to do is have remote access to the base. So to do that, we're going to need some things. I haven't done this in so long. I think it, why are these all named the same? I guess it don't matter. Two diamond gears give me a remote order, but I need... A request table, I think. But I need a remote pipe or something. Let me um, all the blue has to do with fluid. So I would use the remote order logistics pipe along with the provider. And let's see, I don't know why I should worry with this until I get an AE system up and going with storage. And then connect. Yeah. I'm just going to hold off on this entirely until we get our AE network set up. Then I'll set up a remote doohickey with this and go from there. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed, and as always, take it easy.